Hi, my name is Mark Wagner, and um, we've got uh, some beautiful Springer Spaniels. They're English Springer Spaniels, and this is the field breed, and we have eight of them. We have uh, four males and four females, and uh, we're going to show you them today. And before you start, I'd like to show, introduce you my amazing Grace Wagner. Gracie, take a look. Hey, Gracie girl. Hi, girl. This is a, she's a, a, a field uh, uh, English Springer Spaniel. Field meaning that their uh, hair is shorter than a show dog. They have, uh, their tails are not uh, docked uh, as, as short as, as, uh, as a um, okay. show dog, but they are uh, they're very silky. This one's a very silky fur, and so is her, the father. Uh, Gracie is, um, comes from a line of, uh, of uh, AKC uh, field dog champions. So does the father, and we'll talk a little more about that later. I'd like to introduce to you is the, the, the first... Uh, this is the uh, firstborn male. Her name is Birdie. Named by his for his little bird pattern. We thought it's just a crib name. It's a name that you can change. And this little guy, really adorable. He's got that uh, same little face. The eyes and the ears are sealed right now. They can't see or hear, but boy, they can smell. And uh, there's a the little guy right there. Little male, beautiful male, beautiful markings. Little champion in the making right there. Next one I introduce to you is uh, this one. This is the next male. This was the uh, third in line, third one born, and this is, we call him Stash. Uh, you can see a little birthmark there on the bottom left lip. It's kind of mm -hmm. cute. Uh, everybody likes it. We got a little, he's the only one with a little dot on, the, on his forehead. He's got a lot of markings on the back, and they're pretty uh, symmetrical. And uh, just a cute little guy. Oh, just a cute little, little guy. And uh, he's a little heavier than the rest. He's definitely taking a lot more milk than the rest, and uh, right now, He's just a terrific little little puppy. How's that? And there it is. That's Stash. He is another male. Another male I'd like to show you is this one. This is a Champ. A little Champ right there. Another little male. There's his face right there. I think he's the one with a, he has a little heart-shaped uh, divided uh, face as well. And if you take a look at this, he has this kind of unique pattern on the back. Looks a little bit like Birdie, but a little bit different. A little spot near his tail, a little just a little guy. Yeah, they're all they're all about the same weight. They're all about the same weight right now. There there's not one runt in all of them. Another beautiful little male, just ready to go, and uh, just a lot of fun. Just a real spark. Next, I'm going to show you. This was uh, now, now champion was number four in the litter, and uh, this is Valentine. Valentine is a little heartbreaker. He's another male. You can see the little heart shape. That's why we call him that. The crib name. And he's got a spot back on the back of his tail. You can see his uh, beautiful little face, and it's also hard on the on the on his forehead as well. And a uh, little cute little male. He was uh, number eight, eighth one born, and uh, just a little guy, just a great. Again, they're all the same weight, and they're really healthy. Uh, now I'm going to go into that ends of the males. That's four males, and we're going to start off with. Oops, <laughs> we're go to Valentine. The one I want to show you next is, uh, you can see they're pretty rough and tough as well. This one is the second born uh, girl, the female, named, uh, we call her Ocho, uh, because it was just a nicer name. We think it looks like a number eight to us. <laughs> Cute little markings all the way back to the tail. And um, there it is, beautiful little Ocho. She's a, whoops, there we go. And it's a, a female, first female. Actually, it was a second one born. And uh, there is his, all his markings. And then we have here. This is uh, Aussie. Looked like the uh, looked like Australia on the back there. Um, it's virtually no other. I don't see any other marking on there at all. You should you probably can, have lots of speckles. You should probably like all of these will speckle up and they feather up. They feather up all over. Feathers are extra uh, hair that comes off all over the place. Off their legs are beautiful. This one has a really wavering coat. They're real waverly coats, so it's going to be unique. And another really unique little dog. And Can you turn our head around? there is uh, Ozzy, and um, there's a beautiful little girl. Okay, so that's Ozzy. And another one, Ozzy was number five in the litter. And then we have Double Dot. Double Dot has really just virtually two little dots on the back. Right here, tail, and in the center, she has a little divided face, beautiful. And uh, again, another female. 
And that's double dot, number six. And then seventh in the litter, and this is the last of the four females, is, uh, this is Thousand Islands. Thousand Islands is a female. And if you look back here, you can see uh, the extra dots she has back in here. So there it is. And that is it, four and four. Now these uh, dogs are a, are a field, field dog, and you can see there's a lot more white on them than you would see as a, as a show dog. And these dogs are ready to, uh, they are just uh, phenomenal. Uh, they're, they're bred for uh, being very smart. Uh, be attentive to the, uh, to the, the guy, whoever's leading them, myself. They hunt for, for you. Um, if you're with other people, they'll hunt for you. You can teach them to, uh, they come readily. Uh, to their name. They're really easy to teach to re retrieve. They do, it's called quartering, almost right off the bat. We hardly had a teacher that at all. She learned it right away. If I turn one way or another, she turns right with me. She's always looking back at me, very attentive. Uh, Gracie is, uh, is the dog I mostly spend the most time with. She has a, 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 tune, a very great ability to pay attention and stay close. If I tell her to stay close or, or I, I tell her to come back, I've never had to use any electronic command on her. Uh, only have had to use a whistle and voice commands, and um, and she's been phenomenal to train. Very very smart dog. She is a uh, a uh, she is from an AFC lines, which are their field champion lines. I think I mentioned already. Her uh, her father is a field champion, a Canadian field champion. Gracie, um, uh, number one. There she yeah. is. And um, and she's not a field champion. Although I think I'm going to do that with her. Do more with her and the. And, uh, and do some more training with her because she's so easy to train. But her um, ranger, her mate, is the father of these puppies, is uh, also a field champion, only a year and a half old, and, is, and has medaled three times. And her grandparents. And, and her. all the lines. All our lines are all field champions, just about all of them. And you can just take a look at that and the, and the. She's an amazing. And the information. Family dog. She's an amazing family dog, and she learns all kinds of tricks. Uh, only, not only tricks in the field, but tricks in the home. Hey, the Gracie. girls have taught her to close doors, to to uh, to sit pretty, to um, you know, to get up, to come down, to come to hand. Um, just a lot of different tricks. You guys have taught her. Taught her to bark on command. She actually barks for my another dog because she's a little bit older to use the bathroom. Just a phenomenal dog. L listens and learns really, really quickly. Um, that's it. They're very, very athletic and just very family dogs. Mm -hmm. And I can't say enough about them. I always tell people that okay. these dogs are so smart. If they had uh, audible thumbs, they probably could. Uh, they could probably help me with working on my car. Cute little dog. Whoops! I'm going in too far. There I'm go. messing it up. There you go. Sorry. There they are. Amazing Grace and her eight puppies. <laughs> We're so proud of you. The only advantage about having these puppies too at this time of year, if you are uh, you do want to hunt next fall, we put uh, Gracie was a little later. She was like a, a spring dog also, and uh, she was uh, had had uh, flushed and. Uh, and retrieved uh, uh, three pheasants uh, on her first year, and she was just a little. She could hardly was. She's hardly big enough to carry a pheasant. And it was a really exciting year. Just get started. So, so there you go. And uh, if you're interested, please give us a call at three eight zero six six seven zero with a three one five area code. And uh, there it is. Amazing Grace's um, uh, field champions. Mm -hmm. And um, give us a call if you're interested. Thank you very much for your interest.